If you have a backyard shed for housing lawn equipment, tools, lawnmowers, you probably need a ramp to gain access to the shed itself because most sheds are built slightly above ground level. This is left on at Do It Yourself Home Improvement Plus. This shed is a 12 by 14 foot shed built on a pressure treated platform that is supported underneath with concrete columns. The shed platform is actually built approximately six inches above the grade. So consequently they needed a ramp to get from the ground or the grade into the shed. We chose to build a concrete ramp in two sections. The reason we chose the concrete, the concrete will be here probably another hundred years, whereby a wood, wood ramp will probably rot out in 10 to 20 years depending on the type of material. And when it comes to cost, it's actually a little cheaper to build a concrete ramp, assuming you mix the concrete yourself, than it is to purchase the wood and build a wood ramp, particularly if this ramp will last five times longer than a wood ramp. This ramp is approximately five feet wide and it um, extends from the shed another six feet. The overall slope of the ramp is approximately six inches from the beginning of the ramp to the threshold of, this, of the shed. To construct the ramp, we simply took two by fours and made a form for the first section on three sides dug out the center of it, filled it with crushed stone, and made concrete consisted of one-third stone, one-third gravel, and one-third regular Portland cement. We mixed that into a stiff texture, poured it into the form, leveled it off, and let it set up approximately 24 hours. Then we moved the form to the, out, to the second section. As you can see, the second section has a larger slope, or more of a slope, than the first section. Okay, and the reason we did it that way is so as we move the equipment in and out, the bottom of the equipment doesn't drag on the, on the threshold. Once we poured the second section, exactly like we did the first section, we removed the forms in approximately 24 hours and backfilled the whole thing with gravel. And the reason we use gravel is because we want the water to run off and absorb into the gravel rather than running and making puddles in places that we don't want. This entire shed is built approximately six inches above the ground grade, and it's back filled with gravel all around it, so the water will run away from the shed as it comes off the roof. That's all there is to building a ramp for a backyard shed. For more information on Do It Yourself Home Improvement Project, take a look at our website at Do It Yourself.